Destroya, one of the most dangerous kaiju to exist because he's always crabby. Today, we're going to compare Kaiju Arisen's Destroya and Kaiju Universe's Destroya by three categories power, looks, and it factor. It factor is what makes them special and sexy in their own way. Well, not sexy. That <laughs> Leave a like on the video so one day this gets recommended to my dad and he can see just how far I sunk our bloodline. All right, first, we got looks. So looks wise, this is going to be tough for Kaiju Universe. It's going to be a difficult battle because Kaiju Arisen has a much, much newer destroyer. Oh, I, ooh, my shirt tastes good. What the hell? <laughs> oh, it's just around my mouth. I think I dropped soda. Am I an animal? Jesus Christ. Okay, so here we have the Void Destroyer. There's squids on the beach. Now, Void Destroyer is really all that needs to be... That little bastard just shot crap at me. All that really needs to be brought up when discussing Destroyer's looks in this game. Look at them. They're coming at me. You people make me sick. You're spitting more crap at me. There's, there's one behind me as well. This beach belongs to them. Oh my God, I got crap on my face. It is freaking beautiful. The lack of wings on the Void Destroy is crazy. That little portal, that black hole space, absence of light, dead center of its chest is just mysterious as hell. Versus Kaiju Universe. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm sorry. This this thing is just old as hell. It, honestly, there was once a time when this was the most beautiful destroyer ever. For years, this was the most beautiful destroyer ever. This is just the most gorgeous, gargantuan thing to ever walk the seas. But now it is not. It went from the most epic Kaiju crab you've ever seen to just the kind of crabs you could get from a public toilet. This is probably the easiest one to grade out of the three categories we chose today. Like, the looks, looks was the easiest obvious one <laughs> so for now we're gonna have to give the first one looks to kaiju arisen but one day this game will update their destroyer and then one day we'll have to decide again all right now let's see what's more powerful the kaiju arisen one or the kaiju universe one i feel like this is way more important power this is like how usable they are okay one thing that already makes this destroyer way weaker everyone should know about is is any beam grounds it if any atomic breath touches it whatsoever the creature gets grounded which is a huge disadvantage. Another thing, it also can't use its beams in the air. That's so brutal. This thing is neutered in so many ways, it's crazy. This Godzilla doesn't seem to want the beef. I think he's typing out something instead. I think he's saying, don't attack me. Okay, we gotta find one who's gonna fight back. That's, <laughs> that's how we determine strength. All right, Final Wars, let's get it on. Come on, dude, we're fighting. <laughs> Come on, fight me. There we go. See, instantly grounded. He's actually done a lot of damage to us, but now he's still running back a bit. He, um, a lot of the damage done to us was just done to ourselves through the floral beam. Don't you run from me. Everyone just runs from destroy. It's freaking exhausting. Woof. I flung him in the air. <laughs> That's cool. Ah, oh, it's so cool. It's wings folded up like that. Oh, defensive and scary. Can he even attack me up here? Am I beyond his grasp? Uh-oh, he's getting weakened. His days are numbered. Better this, this is just sad. I just feel bad now. I'm gonna kill this guy's brother right in front of him. Give me oh, God. Oh, my God. I literally let the Final Wars live, and now he's bugging me when I'm in the middle of another fight. That's why you never let anybody live right there. Great. Now they're all against me. That is the last time I ever spared someone's life. I swear to God. <laughs> God Slayer, I will now hunt you for the rest of your life. Now he has to know. He's just made an enemy for life right there. Oh, he quit. <laughs> That's so funny. Victorious. All right, the destroyer of Kaiju Universe. How powerful are thee? Look how little everything. This thing looks so skinny now. Look at skinny arms. It's so scrawny. Everything else looks tiny too, though. Like that Kong. Oh, wait, that's just a little Kong. Okay. <laughs> I was like, wow, the Kongs look so much smaller than I remember. <laughs> you idiot, Johnny. All right, who are we going to kill? Everyone's a little. No one really poses much of a threat around here. Even this Shin Godzilla looks tiny. My vision's being obscured. Oh, he beat me first. All right, that's how it's going to be. And that is how it shall be, you little rat. Oh, I got freaking grounded by his back beeps. 
It literally happened to me in both games, dude. That's brutal. I'm fighting very sloppy, you'll notice right now. It's because there's not, not really much risk going on. It's just a Shin Godzilla versus a Destroy, you know? Ooh, this Frost Godzilla's being a stinker. This is where Destroyer's nerf came in big time in Kaiju Universe, is your beams now take like 20 hours to repair. So if you can't really fight two stuff as easily as before. Just one thing. Frost Godzilla, it's important to me that you know you're gonna die right now for ruining my 1v1. Where are you? So invisible in the water. Where is he? It's a freaking ice cube. It, <laughs> it's hard to find an ice cube in the water. Enough of these games. All right, it's over. There, done. They're both so freaking strong, and they both kill one kaiju so easily. What it comes down to is who could kill two kaiju easily or easier. And I gotta be honest, when it comes down to killing two kaiju, I gotta personally give it to this one. This, the oh, I'm dead. They've been beaming me this whole time. <laughs> I didn't notice. I wasn't paying attention. So far, Kaiju Arisen has looks one and Kaiju Universe has power one, but now who's gonna win the it factor? And now for the it factor. Which one is just generally more badass? You know what I mean? I do love this thing's handling a lot because it can fly backwards in and out of- How did you not hit me once right there? My health didn't even budge. I was moving back and forth way too quick for him. I'm gonna land on the storage ship and shoot you in the face now for that. Well, now I'm holding pretty still. I'll be like, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. He's doing that thing they do. Can I not fly out of water? Hang on. <laughs> Can I not fly out of water? <laughs> oh my God. What the hell is this? Stop shooting me. Hang on. Let me figure this out. <laughs> Can I not fly out of, I think I'm stuck in the water. Oh, wow. Oh, screw you, bro. Screw it. Like a bird that fell in the water. And I just got to kind of float to shore before I can fly. This is embarrassing. Look who's finally breached. Okay, that is a huge point deduction right there for Destroyer. I love being able to fly around in 360 degree views, but not being able to fly out of the water is brutal, dude. Go ahead and get a little closer. Oh, it's going back up. Oh, it's just me who backed up. That move is supposed to launch them backwards. <laughs> it just launched me backwards. That's so embarrassing. Dude, even that tank is ganging up on me. There, now the tank is... Is the tank dead? Oh my god. Okay, it's pretty fun to use this thing, but it's also such a big, clunky, tremendous beast that it has some pretty big disadvantages. Okay, destroy it in Kaiju Universe. It's a pretty fun thing, and honestly, it's not very big or bulky. It allows for extreme navigation throughout the buildings, which is incredibly helpful. Actually, this thing's ridiculously small, I now realize, like, compared to the buildings, and this is a crazy small destroyer. I feel like this is a giant advantage, being tiny, or, like, not tidy but just like not jimongous i don't know i'm kind of leaning towards kaiju universe with the uh, i keep getting spotted i bounce back and forth to like five different servers and i keep getting spotted i like to hide from subscribers that way i can be very toxic and no one will try to cancel me <laughs> what it ultimately comes down to however is this the ability to beam while in the sky. It is just the greatest gift you could ever give somebody. Look, I destroyed the subscribe. Thank you. <laughs> he wanted me to sign his mom's feet. Now that's a good lad right there. We're gonna give Destroyer the it factor, therefore claiming Kaiju Universe as the winner. I'm not biased. I love both games. It's literally just because this one could like freaking maneuver better and beam from the sky. It's so much better. Of course, Kaiju Arisen 5.0 is in the works, so the new Destroyer might be even better. But of course, Kaiju Universe will probably make a new destroyer as well one day, so that one might be even better. -er. What's going on, little fella? So leave a like on the video, subscribe if you guys want to see more, and I'll see you next time.